secondary pathway. The cell bodies of the first order of sensory neurons of auditory pathway lies in the spiral or cochlear ganglion. Only. They are bipolar neurons. It has a central process and a peripheral process. The peripheral process arising from the spiral ganglion reaches the organ of copy. The central process forms the copier nerve. The fibers of the copier nerve bifurcates and relays in the dorsal and ventral copier nucleus. Dorsal and ventral copier nucleus. The second order of sensory neurons arising from the copier nuclei that is dorsal and ventral copier nucleus crosses to the opposite side in the trapezoid body and relays in the superior olivary nucleus. Some of the fibers are uncrossed. The third order of sensory neurons arise from the superior olivary nucleus and forms the lateral lemniscus. The lateral lemniscus is the principal ascending auditory tract. Most of the fibers relay in the medial geniculate body while few fibers relay in the inferior colliculus that is the center for auditory reflexes. The medial geniculate body is the main station for the auditory pathway or the auditory tract. The fibers arising from the medial geniculate body constitutes the fourth order of sensory neurons and they form the auditory radiations which passes through the sublentiform part of the internal capsule and finally relates in the primary auditory area present in the Hazel's gyrus or superior temporal gyrus. Thank you.